Suella Bravman is saying some very provocative things today, and arguably making her case to be the leader of the Conservative Party after the next election. Our forecasts, predictions and expectation management correspondent Jonathan Goodenough has more. Yes, that's right, the Home Secretary is expected to say some very negative things about the Refugee Convention, things that will go down very well with the right of her party. What kind of things? Well, it's thought that she'll say that refugees aren't really refugees unless they're in black and white, and that we now live in a different time. Right. And it looks like she'll add that 780 million people could claim asylum in the UK, which as far as she's concerned is 780 million too many. Where did she say all this? She'll say all of this later today at a right-wing American think tank in Washington DC, following in the illustrious footsteps of people like Oliver Dowden and Liz Truss, who were also taken seriously there for some reason. So, sorry, has the speech actually happened yet? No, but she is anticipated to say a lot of things that the right-wing press will enjoy, which is why she's on the front pages of all of them today. So if she hasn't given the speech yet, how do you know what she's going to say? Because the text of her speech was sent to the media in advance. Why is that? Well, probably so she can get all of the glowing headlines beforehand, just in case the speech actually doesn't go well, or she says something stupid during the Q&A. So you're basically reporting a press release as fact. Uh, Doesn't that make what you're doing not journalism, but PR? No, I wouldn't say that. But maybe she will. That's certainly possible, but not anticipated. Thank you, Jonathan. Next up, as confusion reigns over Rishi Sunak's plans for HS2, we ask, where exactly is Old Oak Common? And why would people from Birmingham want to get there quite fast? 